Hello, this is the 2002 WRX Bug Eyes um, car walk around and start up and everything. All right, first of all, uh, it's got a little bit of a lift in it because the previous owner did a Forester spring conversion. So, and the tires are actually uh, bigger than the stock ones. Um, I actually put brand new tires on it less than 5,000 miles ago. Uh, let's see. <sighs> I'll get you some light so you can see how deep the tread is there. Uh, brakes are good. Um, when I and let's swap do the tires. They're uh, a fifty thousand mile tire, I believe. Uh, let's see. Uh, I do have seat covers on it. Um, the previous owner did some customizations like right here is the for the cup holder and stuff. Um, interior is pretty good. I have car seats in it because of my kids. Um, let's see. Everything works. Uh, cruise works. Um, good space. Let's see. Oh, hold on a second. Um, let's see the. Uh, I do have uh, copies of the paperwork that I did. Um, like you can see that the that's cracked. Um, the windshield. It's good. There's no cracks in the windshield. Um, let's see. I will start it up here. Um, it does have an aftermarket boost gauge. Uh, you can see right there. Um, uh, when I got it, it wasn't um, wired very well. As in, like, there was no container right here for it or anything like that, so... I got that and did that. Stereo works, heat, AC work, cruise works, fog lights work. Um, uh, the ABS light is on because one of the sensors is bad. I have not replaced that sensor. Uh, the brakes are good. No issues there. Um, let's see. Uh, the, the, yes, this does work because I use it for power cord for the phones. Let's see. Get the... I did change the oil about uh, 1, 1,500 miles ago. I don't drive this car that much. Um, sorry if the noise is too loud. Uh, this is the motor. Um, so the previous owner's friend took it out, put it all back together, but he forgot a check valve, and so it wasn't doing good on the boost. And so it was only producing about 7 PSI. I took it to a couple different shops. Um, I will pull out the paperwork here for you on that. Um, let's see. Oh, the uh, there, you probably hear me better. Where is it? Here is the tires receipt, as you can see, from Les Schwab, and they have. Done at 2:08. It is now at 2:10, and you can see right there that the phone and they checked all the brakes from the same time. You can totally do that if you like. I have a way to show you that. Let's see. Um, where's my other paper? As you can see, it's idling fine from a uh, heater. Feel it up. I don't know if you can hear that or not. But yeah, AC works. Rear defroster works. Rear wiper works. Front wipers work. Uh, 
let's see. Uh, what other questions do you have? I had uh, Warren Automotive, a local place here, fix the problems that were that were done. Um, so you can see right here, it was the uh, had a vacuum hose with integrated check valve. And what was happening is when I you the the boost wasn't working, and that was why. Um, the uh, right here it says the vacuum hose is repaired, but were repaired but routed incorrectly. Turbo gauge not hooked up. Relocated boost gauge hose, but now boost now between 15 to 18 psi, like it's supposed to. Uh, I had all that done because. Uh, when I took it to another place, they said, oh, this is all that's wrong, and then we're not going to work on it. Uh, you have to make another appointment. And so I was like, okay. Um, got the original Subaru manual with all the all the fun stuff. Uh, it was originally from San Jose. Let's see. Oh. Walk around. You can see the exhaust. It's cold, but you can see there's no funny colors from it or anything like that. Uh, let's see. Um, I if I don't get full price, I'm keeping the uh, roof rack, just so you know. Uh, other than that, um, like the shifter is not standard. It's actually a um, custom 3D printed one that the guy did previous to me. But the guy did a bunch of work previous to me and then uh, had some things that were hooked up wrong. That's why if you notice the uh, whole color of the uh, uh, motors have changed and everything else. When I got it, uh, when I got it, the... Uh, Valve cover gasket leaked and I replaced that after that was replaced and I had the work done at uh, Warren Automotive. Everything has been working great. Uh, the reason I'm selling it is because I have 10 cars and I'm trying to get rid of a couple of them. So if you uh, have any more questions than that, let me know. Uh, um, I did get the uh, key fobs and I have two of them and two keys. Um, other than that, I think that should cover it about all. Uh, if you want to schedule a time to come look at it, just let me know. Uh, the paint is kind of fading and peeling in some places. You can see it right here, like that and that. I had a little bit of rust here, so I uh, hit it with some primer. Other than that, that is what it looks like. Um, so if you have any more questions that isn't covered in the video, uh, give me a, a call and I'll try to fill them as best as I can. Thanks.